I guess I figured after the Bucks Suns game where the Bucks actually won in Phoenix, I guess I'm in the basketball mood. Hey guys, welcome to Solo Dolo Sports YouTube channel. Wow, basketball. Western Conference Conference Semifinals versus the Dallas Mavericks. We're here to do games one and two. And we're at home. Because the Mavericks are the seventh seed, we are the sixth seed. We took care of the Timberwolves. Four games to none. They didn't even win a game. Dallas, you know, got got their stuff done in six. So we're real rested. We're at home. And pretty much this Dallas team is the same Dallas team we faced last year. Same players and everything. I mean, pretty much. Pretty much same players. We'll check the roster out. And turn this uh, volume up. Yeah, Luka Dockage, uh Chris Pospozingas, Derek Rose is still there, Malik Monk, yes. Tim Hardaway, Jalen Brunson, Stanley Johnson, Corey Adams, yep, Jer Cortas Adetokounmpo, uh, I guess that's uh, Giannis's brother. Congratulations to the Bucks and congratulations to Giannis. So I'm pretty much taking, but they haven't done anything yet. Of course, you got to win again. You got to win at least one more game. Which is a lot easier than Phoenix having to win two games. But you never know. More interesting series than I thought it was going to be between the Bucks and Suns. I mean, so. Got my interest. But here we are. We're going to start the semifinals. This video will be posted probably on Sunday or Monday. So here we go. And, of course, in the other series, we got Denver and the Clippers, of course, advance. Over in the east, it's Miami and Atlanta, and then Milwaukee and 76ers. Um, the Forest, really good story out of the east. Um, they couldn't even get, they, 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 they won two games, tied series of two, but basically the Sixers are just too talented. They got Kawhi Leonard and Joel Embiid and, some other real superstar over there. They're a really good team. So, I didn't expect them to win. But we're going to get to this series. Our series. Play a game. For this, let's see what I'm going to do. Maverick's got some weird uniform combination. Some of them look really good, and some of them look really weird. We'll go there with that. Thus, I guess we can start off with the whites. Let's keep things simple. And here we go. And yeah, I just finished a couple hours ago um, the Titans franchise. AFC Championship game versus the Chiefs. We win that game 9-7 to seven in a defensive battle. And the Titans are now moving on to the Super Bowl. I will post, of course, who will be our opponent. It's either the Eagles or the Cowboys. I'll let you guys chew on that if you're chewing that for a while for you. You know, and, that's, and just not tell you. Let you chew on it for a while. Who made it? But, you know, if you know Madden, you probably know who made it. <laughs> That's the only thing I can tell you. Sir, 
survivors in the West meeting here in the conference semifinals, game one. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Doris Burke. Also joining us from the sidelines, David Aldridge. The big story is the return of Montrez Harrell from yes. being injured. Oh, man, injuries, oh, they can just be so tough. The pain, the rehab, there's a monotony to it. Not being able to help your team out on the court. All of it, it, it weighs on you. And I'm sure he's excited and relieved to finally be back in uniform. You know, and I think this team is ready to rally around his return. He can give them that extra spark they've been missing. Boy, he, he has really been missed. Now, we'll look at Dallas's starting lineup. Ron Jitchin, Porzingis, the incredible forward pair. Jalen Brunson out there with Monk. And it's Fareed in at the five spot. Okay, well, let's go down to David Aldridge for a report from the sideline. Thank you, Kevin. I caught up with Vancouver's head coach. We spoke about his approach coming into game one. He said we can't let our guard down. Being the higher seed means nothing if we come out flat. We have to play as though we have something to prove. The last thing we want is to lose home court. We'll see if they can come out with that energy that the coach is asking for. Thanks, David. Here's Brzingis, Jabari Parker making his last shot. And it's blocked. Blocked by a war. Showing some activity on the defense. Get in there, Parker. I like that. The shot is off. That's the kind of D you need when he's got the ball near the hoop. They are all over. Man, can you always depend on him or what to lead you to the right place with that pass? Money. Oh. Now, here's one. There's the pass to Evans. Back to Warren. The three. Doesn't go for him. And the Mavericks going the... I mean, we'll see how it goes, but right now I got Harold coming off the bench. I mean, he's just got off an injury. Adams has not played that bad, so I'm keeping him in the starting rotation. That can change if he struggles, though. Garland, all right. And this is what I need Garland for. I need him to play like a superstar in this series. We can make the Western Conference finals, man. And I didn't even go out and get a superstar. I really just did not, I did not go out and get another a superstar. I went and got basic players, and I go to the Western Conference Finals, I will be very, very happy. I just don't think Dallas is going to shoot like they did last seat, last off, last, last playoffs, where they really didn't have it, the shot together, they weren't making shots, and we sort of took advantage of it. TJ Warren, right there, baby. T.J. Warren has showed up in the playoffs, man. He's been showing up as of late. Really like that. Another shot by uh, Jalen Brunson. He has some weapons. The Montez Arrow's on the bench for right now. I will put him in. We'll see how it goes. If I have struggle, if, if Adam struggles to, woo, Warren is hot. Warren is hot. Playoffs, I told you. His points per game is up. His field goal percentage is up. He's doing the damn thing. Loving TJ Warren right now. And that acquisition in the offseason, now is, I'm looking like a genius right now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm looking like a genius. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's pour it on him. Nope, but Adams gets it back and gets the offensive rebound and gets the score. That's what you got to love about my boy, Steven Adams. Come on. Pass to Doncic. Nice D from Warren. Vancouver leading by four. There's Garland. Garland. Ooh. Nice form on the 20-foot. Garland. Pass where your teammate can do something with a nice. And so it's Dungeons with it. He brings it up for the Dallas Mavericks. And three kicks to Perzingis. Pass to Dungeons. The 19 foot shot. A second chance effort. For oh, the last to Perzingis. Dungeons against Warren. 
Kareem. Oh, it tips it in. Mike Kareem. Tips it back in. To get the tip in, just wanting it a little bit more. Here's Vancouver with the ball. Four point game. Pass it to Adams. Kicks to Garland. The pass to Parker. Shoots it. it. It's rebounded by Dallas. And Brunson has it in the corner. Oh, doesn't get it. Get the rebound! Oh! It's hauled in by Adams. Oh, Adams has got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Evans kicks to Garland. Doncic against Warren. To the paint, Adams, and five on the five. shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. It goes on Kenneth Fareed. Well, we all know Stephen Adams is one of the most physical guys in the NBA. He is so solid at using his body to pick up fouls. That one is off. Boy, there's just a brute strength and physicality about Steven Adams. This guy knows his role and plays it to perfection. That one is no good. Mavericks trail by four. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Oh. Brunson, good. Got it. And how about Mark there scanning the floor for the open teammate? That's how you develop a trust from your teammates. Arlen gets to Adams. Now, here's Warren. Four. He's got yes. closely. It's good. Warren's got six. Warren's gone three for seven tonight. Wayne Dungeon. He's covered by Warren. And the whistle wow. blows. It's going to be on Jabari Parker. That's his first foul. And Trezero, he's checked in for Vancouver. And Trezero and for yeah. Dallas. Tim Hardaway Jr. comes in for Malik Monk. And it's Rose in for Jalen Brunson. Here's Dungeon. Goes wow. to the reverse layup and pops it in. He's got six. I'll tell you, Luka Doncic makes tough shots look easy. Boy, that close to the bucket through that much contact? Nice. Now, here's one. He has six. Evans feeling it out a bit. Down to five on the shot clock. Harold trying to free himself. Ooh! T.J. Warren hits from deep. Wow, if T.J. Warren makes threes with consistency, it will unlock every other aspect of his game, and that's significant, guys. Here is Rose. If he this does that, the way. I think you can pretty much zip it less in for that Western Conference Finals. Back to Rose. And if I get a little bit of protection from everybody else, that'd be great. Zingas can't hit. Vancouver leading by five. Evans, that's a two-pointer. And the shot is long. And he rushed that one, no doubt about it. Yeah. When he out of his position, you can see the frustration on his face. Now, here's Doncic. He's got six. To the inside. Shoots over Garland. Oh. And it's good from Doncic on the assist from Hardaway. And it's eight points for Luka Doncic. Oh, yeah. He's a superstar. Evans passes to Garland. And the call it's not going to be sends him to the line. Not going to be on the Madden 22 cover for nothing. Over for Vancouver, they have missed <laughs> both free throws they've attempted tonight. Evans. <laughs> That's good for Madden and Vancouver with some changes. Michael Kidd Gilchrist is checked in for Adams. Tamari Carroll comes in for Warren. And Trey Burke subbed in for Garland. And then for Dallas. Johnson, he's checked in for Reed. And it's Adams in for Doncic. And both three goes. Good for Evans. An average trail by five. Well believe. Outside Rose. Outside Hardaway. 
the Phaedra Adams. Perk, that could have had him. The fadeaway jumper. Well, you want some unselfishness from a guy who's capable of scoring. And Tim Hardaway says, you know what? My teammate's open. I'm going to get him the ball. Now, here's Burke. Yes, Burke. Yeah, there it is again. On a lot of good versions this first half. Oh, points again. Was great. That was a strong point. I love that. A bench point guard, man. Goes with the ball. Might be that time from here. Yep. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. And boy, to have someone back there who can erase oh. your mistakes. What a big time asset defensively. Darryl. And another shot. Darryl with the rebound. Defensively, if you allow him to get this close, you're playing with fire. He just happened to miss that one. Now, here's Burke, who's covered by Rose. Harold against Johnson. Go in there, Harold. Here we go. Well. Great D that time from Johnson. And so it's Johnson who brings the ball up for the Dallas Mavericks. Trailing by five. Nice shot by Przingis. Very hard to contend with a player with the size and touch and well-rounded offensive game that Kristaps Porzingis has. Burke, the pass to Harold. Burke with yes. it. Look on Rose. And that one's good. Great work. And Vancouver leads by five. How about someone else has turned it on in the playoffs? Rose scanning the floor. Pass to Adams. Outside Hardaway. A three-pointer is right on target. How about the timing from Hardaway Jr. looking very comfortable taking shots after catching the pass. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the contact. Yeah, way to play in attack mode and get to the line. For Vancouver, they have gone two of four at the free throw line. First one falls for Vancouver making a switch here. And so he makes both from the line. Mavericks trail by four. Rose passes to Hardaway. Outside, Brzingis. Rose in the post. He's covered by yeah. Kate Gilchrist. Rose yeah. hits the bucket. Yeah. When you come off the screen that hard and that fast, so difficult to stay with Derrick Rose. Passes it to Kiro. Kiro against Porzingis. Kiro gets the berth. Six on the shot clock. Five. And deep three-point range. The shot, no good. Now the Mavericks take it the other way. Well, you, you have to like their work on the boards, Kevin, particularly here to start the game. Good steal, my bird. In transition, here comes Vancouver. Here's Dean. Off to the draw. The Mavericks trailing. Rose passes to Persingas. No good. That would have tight. Not sure what, what the D was doing there. Clearly a breakdown. You can ill afford to give a guy like him that good a look. Vancouver working the ball around now. Harold. Porzingis with the rebound. Porzingis has got his sixth rebound on the night to the middle. And he gets oh. the and officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. Well, we've seen that movie. Yeah, I can know. This is gonna this is gonna be a tough series. Uh, last year we we beat them in five games and I didn't expect it because he seemed to just kind of have a losing streak going into the playoffs. It wasn't really good, but uh, it's a talented Dallas team. Very talented. They can beat us. They can definitely beat us. So. Um,
like the way Burke is playing, like like what he brings to the table, loving what TJ Warren's doing. Harold, I think, is trying too hard. And Dean needs to, like, calm down. I don't know why in the world he's just barreling in, just throwing up everything. Look at that. They're getting rebounds, too, so that's not a good sign. And we played really, really good. Up until when the second rotation came in. And it kind of got different. I mean... We played, really shot the ball well and everything, and we only, and the game is pretty much even. So, this is not going to be a very easy series. You got to bring it. And uh, right now, yep, Porzingis is hot. We're going to sim. I can't have this video be too long. If it's too long. Nobody's going to want to watch it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? If it's too long, you might not even want to watch it. Heck, I don't even watch long videos. I put them on in case I want to go to sleep. I mean, I very rarely watch my own videos. So we're going to send it. We're going to slow it down a little bit. Let's see where this is going. Right now... Hold on, now they're pulling away, but we're still in it. Very close game. Uh, looks like a five minute mark. Four. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna watch it right now. Wow, with the uh, four point lead with three minutes to go. <laughs> And the first one drops. And yes. that's a bull hook from the line since halftime. Fareed's checked in for the Mavericks. Porzingis is coming in for Tim Hardaway Jr. On the floor right now for the Mavericks. Don Jitchin, Porzingis, the incredible forward pair. That's a glitch. Yeah, no, that's a glitch. And it's Fareed <laughs> in its center. Here's Brunson. Oh, we can't let him get and the rebounds. On the way yeah. Brunson's got five points in the quarter. And you want him taking big shots for you in big moments. That one was as easy as it gets. Boy, when it's this close, you try not to give up these kinds of buckets. Boy, you got to do better defensively. Parker up top. Fareed defending. Just five to shoot. Rebounded oh, by Davis. Parker, you're doing Fareed too much. Six rebounds Pass the, the game. ball. Something that's kept this game close oh. is the fact that the rebound stats for both teams are almost identical. Wow, poor Zingas. No hesitation in the balance of the game. He delivers. Now a timeout called by Vancouver. And they're committing an awful lot of fouls here. Don't you get the ball? Good to start them. You don't want to give up easy layups. Sure, but it's been a non-stop for Pass it off to, to Garland. And now we get the chance to present our Jordan player of the game, T.J. Warren. I knew that was about to happen. It's a terrific night for him in terms of 23 the points. They brought a bunch hey. of sets for him. I look like a genius right now. To come <laughs> you know what I'm saying? As well as he that trade had, looked bad. Now, now it's looking great. The rest of his teammates. Jacob Evans has checked in for Vancouver. Let's go down to the sideline and catch up with David Aldridge. Hey guys, Vancouver's coach got into his team during that timeout. He's happy with how they've been playing. He told them, hey, they had their chance, but this is Oh, we come on, from. Parker. This is our game and our series. He's gotten pretty fired up, Kevin. Here's Brunson to take the lead. Vancouver pulls it in. Adams has got nine rebounds now tonight. Get it, get it, Yes! It was a nice one-handed slam. And how about the poise, Caldwell Pope, 
Obviously, on that possession, they needed an important basket if he was ready and would. Here's Brunson. Oh, it's all good. Good leg, it's up. Hey, Cooper, leading by three. Pass to Evans. No! Too strong. Evans has gone just one five from the field. Fires from Stop 14. It. Oh. It's good from Doncic on the assist by Monk. And that's 21 points for Luka Doncic. One thirty left here in the fourth quarter. Now Parker. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Well, Jabari Parker is a natural born scorer. Let's get fouled, man. If you ain't gonna make no shots. So the first one drops, and that will put him up by two. Let's remember, Jabari Parker was the number two overall pick in 2014. It's just been problematic for him that he's had to fight his way through multiple injuries. T.J. Ward, he's checked in for Contavious Caldwell Pope. So he goes two for two at the line. Maybe it's with the Washington Wizards now. He doesn't let that opportunity slip by. Very some big shots at the line. Come on, guys. Parker against Porzingis. In contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Adam, so he's fouled out. His final foul, and he will sit for the rest of this game. And luckily, they've got terrific depth at that position. If there's one spot on the floor where they can afford to lose somebody, that would probably be it. That is true. Them within two here. Well, you have got to love the versatility of Christoph Porzingis. Unbelievable shooting touch at seven foot three. Can also be a monster on the defensive end. Good luck, future of the NBA. And both free throws good for Porzingis. You must embrace the pressure and knock down critical free throws. Nicely done. Oh, here's Garland. Played by Porzingis. Pass to Evans. Over Monk. Oh, I just came out. Well, defenses are content to give up the mid range. I had a bad right? shot. It just came out. Restricted area oil. Oh, oil. my it's God. Really he just throws it up and gets it in there. So much riding. On that shot, what a bucket. I'll tell you, that changes things, doesn't it? Good job, young fella. What a game. That's the Evans! No! With oh, the can't get the rebound. He is single-handedly dropping the temperature in here. Somebody do some shoot. foul he or something. He's trying to shoot his way out. need the ball back. It might be better for him to pass the basketball at this point. A blunt shot. Oh, it counts. That's over. The it's that over. Has to take that shot. They don't so stole a game on our court. Now a timeout called by Vancouver. We don't, let, by. we don't let them steal a game on our court, man. Yeah. Yeah! What did I say? Oh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Garland. I'm sorry I doubted you. I'm very, very sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. This is what I thought they just gave it away. I thought they gave it away. They did not. We got to force overtime. We got to force overtime. Do not let them get off a good shot. No, we're going to overtime. We're going to overtime.
Wild is still in it, man. What a game. What a game. These teams have battled tooth and nail for four quarters, and now we head to overtime. Should be a blast. We're not going to watch all the overtime. OT, I'm just going to go ahead and do a slow sim real quick. Make it where it's not. Because we got to get in game two. I got to get in game two tonight. A three, a five. Close minutes. We'll jump in right now. And they needed that free throw to fall, and he knew it. Huge shot to make it a one possession game. On Jitchin, Persing is the incredible forward pick. Derek Rose is out there with Monk, and it's Fareed in the pivot spot, manning the middle. Warren against Doncic. Warren yes. Cook. Warren TJ Warren. TJ Warren in a huge moment with the big bucket. They've got the clock just over three and a half minutes into OT. Oh, come on, you can't let him get the rebound. Jake relishes the opportunity to deliver in big moments, and my goodness, embrace the spotlight, young man. Bert the Ward. Yes. Embrace the challenge, TJ Ward. He's out of time. Love it, Bert. I love it. Outside Rose. Oh. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. You flopper. T.J. Warren picks one up. Stop flopping. He's not shy about creating some the margin to just four. Jabari Parker's checked in for Vancouver. Garland comes in for Trey Burke. Don't mind that. The worst rotation is in pretty much. Except for, of course, Stephen Adams. And both free throws. Yeah, he's going to sink him. That's what he does. Those free throws turn That's what he does. a one possession ball game. Warren! Yes! And the foul! And he's fouled out. And so he's picked up his final foul. And he will sit for the rest of this game. Jarrell Martin's checked in for Persingis. DJ Warren. Yeah, he's the MVP of this game. I don't know about the season, but he's playing like an MVP right now.
Also, the no. difference in that one is the one they really want. He's got one more, though. DJ Warren, 34 freaking points. Played like a star. He even outplayed Garland. Garland was great, too. But TJ Warren kept stepped it up, man. He really stepped it up at a time when we really needed some help. Harrell, first game back, 14 points, 5 rebounds, 4 assists. Burke, 12 and 4. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We look good. Steven Adams fouled out. I wonder what he did. I know he only scored like 4 points. He had 10 rebounds, though. So. That was a really good game. Those are the type of games you you almost hate simming and getting out of. And one of those games you just love to, to sit and watch. Uh, yeah, I mean, points in paint, yeah, got them. Rebounds, assists were close. Rebounds were close. Um, really game that went back and forth. They had a three-point lead. We had a six-point lead. Probably lead changes a lot. So it was like a really good game. Close game in the first. Pretty much close game in the second quarter. Close game in the third quarter. Close game in the fourth quarter. These are two really deep. I think these two, these two teams match up very, very well. Uh, I don't think they're going to have a lot of beatdowns in this series. Probably not. Probably not a lot of beatdowns in this series. TJ Warren just played like a freaking uh, stud, man. Uh, made me look like a genius. He just made me look like a genius in the offseason. That's what he just did. He made me look like a genius. You guys didn't get to see the offseason, but I was really disappointed how it went. But he shows up, man, when I needed him to. That is crazy. Wilds more to test value in free agency this summer. Well, we're going to try to keep them. We're going to try to keep them, uh, I feel, uh, I think. But, of course, I could look for another star. I don't know. We'll see how things go. Um, since that was so good of a game one, I don't think I'm going to do too much for game two. I'm probably just going to sim right through it. Arciano is cold, but I don't really have him in the start. He just, so I'm not going to really too much worry about him. Um, we'll keep the lineup the way it is. We're going to just go ahead and start simming. We're going to go ahead and start sim. We're going to just sim game two and see if we get the win. Okay, I don't want to watch it, but. That game was so good, I don't think you can top that game. I don't think you can top that game. We could simulate with SimCast. I'll probably start doing that. And here we go. Uh, we'll simulate... Go ahead and start simulating fast. Really good 
again. Come on, Wild. Oh, well. We can get it. We can get it. We did it! Yes! Parker's 26 points has lies the wild, the wild win over the Mavericks. Return the calendar. Yes, we're up two games to one, two games to none again on the Mavs like we were last year. Man, we are hot for the playoffs. That is awesome news. That is just freaking awesome. Wild too much for the Mavericks. 116 to 112. I didn't think we were going to pull it out at first. 26 points for Parker. 26, 6, and 3. 7 steals. 1 block. Yeah, he was awesome. Jacob Evans. JE, 333. 21 points, 4 rebounds, 6 assists. 18 points for, for uh, TJ Warren. 6 rebounds. 16 points, 9, 12 for Adams. 12 and 2 for Harold Bench. 10 points for Garland, didn't do that much, didn't nearly need to, and that's a good sign. If Garland doesn't have to get off, go off for us to win, that is a good, that is a good sign. Przingis, 32 points, always going to bring it. Hardaway, Brunson, Derrick Rose didn't do that much. Dockage was kind of, kind of out of it. He didn't really score and got rebounds and assists, though. I mean, it was still a close game. Um... Field goals, goes to us, three-pointers, shot pretty, pretty even, free throws. They got to the line a lot, though. Fast break points, points in paint, that's where we beat them. Beat them in points in paint. Bench points, their bench out point mine. Assists, we lead there. Offensive rebounds, they lead there. Defensive rebounds, they lead there. We were out-rebounded. Somehow we're able to still win. But they had 19 turnovers. It's not good. Not good. What do you like about that, guys? Wild. Up two games to none. Heading to uh heading to to Dallas for the next episode. Uh, I'm just gonna push play game. Just to see how these other series are going. Just to see how these other series are going. All right, uh, Denver and, Cl and the Clippers have their series tied at one game apiece. All the other series are tied at one game apiece. We're up two games to none. And we look like we might make it to the Western Conference Finals after all. Which will be very, very cool. Which would be very, very cool. Awesome. Awesome, guys. Well, thank you guys for hanging out with me for more Wild Basketball Games 3 and 4 coming up probably later on in the week. Um, may have more Game 3 and Game 4 sort of more, like more stuff from that game. Didn't really have it in this game. Game two was kind of kind of sin, but I don't think you can top game one. And then we went come out and come out and win game two too. So right now, loving that, loving that. Well, guys, I'll see you later for more wild basketball games three and four in Dallas. Go wild. See you guys later. Solo Dolo out.